is online people i am audible what they are typing audible audible yes yeah. online people those who are any doubt so please don't type because my eyes are already damaged due to senior citizen so unmute yourself and ask whatever you want to ask yes boss but don't ever make the class one way teaching make the what wherever you are facing any doubt stop me otherwise it's like whatever others are teaching the same thing here also there okay boss wherever you are facing any doubt don't think other people are don't ever think other people prestige issue or something we are here to learn in 1999 i only know how many doubt i am unable to answer at that time okay first so wherever possible stop me immediately okay first <clears throat> So next to yeah, next to one more. Somebody typing something. Is somebody typing something? Right, yeah, right. So next to one month, we will start light topics in one month. Then you will adapt to the way I will teach. They adapt to how to ask the question, where to ask the question, what to read, what not to read, how to utilize the given information in the question. This all you can familiarize in this one month. Then we can start the big topic. Okay, first. it's question. It's not about topic is difficult or not. It's not about question is difficult or not. How you understanding is very important. Okay, first. so I will start over today with the small topics. Yes, in GMA. Blood relation. Those who are mathematically weak. And don't write simultaneously. Whatever I will write it in the board at the end of the class, I will share the PDF with you. Okay, first. ask whatever you want to ask. Understood, first. Right. <clears throat> Those who are mathematically weak, so this is your topic. Why? This you will never see any number. Ninety nine point nine nine percent. Rarely you will see numbers in this topic. What type of questions I will show you today? Okay, first. If you understand the concept, then nothing will be there in this topic. In this topic, 2011 to 14, 2015 to 20, the three phases are there in this topic. Then 2021 onwards. What changes are there? After half an hour, I will come to this page. Are you ready? In this topic, you have to assume certain conditions. Sir, why have to assume or remembering the condition you will ask like that? Otherwise, person to person, you will get a different answer. For example, one example I will give you. For example, grandfather. Question says grandfather. Tell me, who is my grandfather? Mother's father also my grandfather. Father's father also my grandfather. That means two answers you will get. Sir, in North India, they will give you preference to father's side. So, papa's side father. Sir, South India, mother's side. So, mother's side grandfather. It is not like this. Understood? So, certain things you have to remember to avoid more than one answer. All already? Remember this thing. You, you can assume it is an assumption or assum assumption or condition, whatever you can do. Don't decide the gender. I have only this one. He is sleeping for me. You have any empty marker? I can write. Yeah. Don't decide the gender based on name in any topics in CSAT. Any topics in CSAT. For example, Swaminathan, male or female is avoid writing uh, while I am teaching. That's my request. Otherwise, you will miss so far what I learned from students' doubt also. 
Otherwise, I can say you can go purchase this book, then you can read that, you can qualify. Understood? So don't write it simultaneously. It is a bad habit because human capacity is 100% at your time, one work only. If you write and listen, you will miss something, whatever I will say. Understood this, boss? So concentrate. Later on, you can copy. Okay, boss? So any topics in CSAT, don't decide the gender based upon the name. Sir, why? You will ask like this. For example, Swaminathan. You know, by seeing me, you know male, male or female. You know first human being or not. Then you know male or female or not. Are you understand this? Katrina Kaif. You know male, human being or not. You know, my girlfriend, don't think the double meaning like that. So, uh, you know human being or not. You know male or female or not. But if Western country people are seeing my name, Swaminathan, first they don't know it belongs to human being or not. How do they know it belongs to which gender? Allah understand this, boss? Same thing for us. If we see their name, somebody name is rice. Biryani rice. Which rice? We don't know. Somebody name is May. Month name. Human being name. We don't know. That is why don't decide the gender based upon the name in any topics in CSAT. Understood? If one only question says, I can use? That's it. So, if one only question says that name belongs to which gender, then only you can fix it. Otherwise, cannot be determined is the answer. Understand this? A, not only blood relation, any topics in CSAT. Getting this, boss? Next. Uh, uh, yes. Very important for your generation. Couples means uh, they must be married. You know why I am saying like that? Because living together, Many different varieties of name your generation are making. So couples means they must be married. And next important, and they must be male and female only. You know why I am saying like that. Don't say, sir, it's a violation of Supreme Court, uh, Section 3, 77. Swami is against like that, not like that. In this topic, couples means male and female only. There is no third gender in this topic. There is no living together in this topic and the same gender couple strictly not allowed in this topic. Understand this? Boss? Right. Next. In a couple, we have to assume husband must be elder than the wife. Based upon that assumption, answers are created. Understand this? Boss? Don't bring any exceptional case like Sachin Tendulkar or anybody. Understood this, boss? So, in a couple, if wife is elder than the husband, then the statement is specifically mentioned. Otherwise, we have to assume what? Husband must be elder than the wife. All are understand this? Getting this, boss? All are getting? Next. Husband side relative or wife side relative. Our wife side relate is not mentioned clearly. Sir, what is the meaning of this? You will ask like that. For example, my sister in law. Who is my sister in law? Who is my sister in law? Brother. Wife, sister, dirty people. My brother's wife also, my sister in law. They're totally silent, eh? That's it. <laughs> my, my brother's wife, I can call sister in law. My wife, sister, I can call sister-in-law. But the question says sister-in-law. Which side is not mentioned? He will assume wife side only. Somebody, one answer. Somebody assuming uh, my male side only. Another answer. So two answers are there. So to avoid that, we need one answer. Are you understood this, boss? Are you understand this? So which side is not mentioned in the statement? We have to assume male side. That means my sister-in-law means my brother's wife. Based upon that assumption, answers are created. All are understood. This. Sir, I am male. My sister-in-law means my brother's wife. Okay. I am female. Who is my sister-in-law? I am female. Who is my sister-in-law? My brother's wife is my sister-in-law. My husband sister is my sister-in-law. Which side is not mentioned in the statement? Two answers you will get 
irrespective of the person is male or female we have to assume from male side only that means uh, my husband sister are you understood or not understood all are understood what i am saying boss don't because it's a male dominated society don't go and inform to any women's organization or anything like that okay boss yes now are you understood what i am saying is any doubt in this so if husband side or wife side or male side or female side is not mentioned in the statement we have to assume what my husband side are you understand this understand name father side relatives paternal side or maternal side paternal side how can you name mother side relatives which side is not mentioned in the statement for example i already told you my grand my grandfather who is my grandfather my father's father or my mother's father two answer possible we need one answer are you understand which side is not mentioned in the statement we have to assume of male side or father side if it is related to mother side statement specifically mentioned if it is related to wife side statement specifically mentioned if wife is elder than the husband statement specifically mentioned otherwise you have to assume husband is elder than the wife husband side or wife side not mentioned we have to assume husband side if father side mother side not mentioned in the statement we have to assume whose side father side remember that so this is maternal side okay boss all are understand this Will understand, sir. Husband side or wife side? Not mention. Assume male side. You said father side or mother side? Not given. Assume male side. You said one person name is there male or female? Not given. Can I assume male? No. That means cannot be determined. Is the answer understood? This boss. If male or female is not mentioned in the statement, don't assume male. Are you understood? This boss. Because we are here habitual of saying that male, male like that. Don't assume the person is male. that this cannot be determined is the all are getting this all are getting this right next oh sir if somebody having kid okay boss for example a is the son of b if somebody having kid and the person must be married what does it mean unmarried person cannot hold a child in this topic are you understand are you understand this and the kid must be biological kid of that person test tube baby not allowed surrogacy not allowed understood this boss adaptation not allowed if it is somebody adopting or surrogacy or anything why because biological children carry their surname parent surname are you understood this boss if they are adopted or artificial child then the statement specifically mention otherwise we have to assume it's a biological kid are you understand this all are understood what i am saying madam ji all are getting this boss and the anybody having kid the person must be married whoever having kid are you an unmarried person cannot having a kid understood this if anybody married at any cost we need information related to their partner national issue where alia but going for taking coffee with whom how many people dying is not important that is very important understood this boss that means if somebody married means we need information related to that partner are you understand is information is given in the question or not we have to see that what information you have to search in the question is the partner is died is given in the question or not is the partner is is the person is divorced or not is the person is what a uh, uh, widow or widower is mentioned in the statement or if the statement this are all you have to search in the given information okay was if the par partner is died then you can answer the question accordingly if the if the statement says that this person is divorced accordingly you can answer the question if the person is wed what is the difference between widow or widower widow is male or female somebody thinking doubt also that widow means what female widower means a uh, male uh -huh, yes 
I forgot to ask that question. If if the question not mentioned partner is died, the person is divorced, the person is widower, widower, not mentioned in the question, then what we have to do? We have to assume partner is alive and we don't have sufficient information. Understood this? Allah understood this first. Anybody doubt? Anybody? Next. The statement says brother, <clears throat> sister, sibling. I am saying uh, Trump is my brother. You know Trump? Huh? Trump is my brother. Then what question you will ask next? I will jump from the building, write your name. <laughs> yeah. So Trump is my brother. Then what question you will ask? Yes. He is your own brother uh, or cousin brother uh, or in-law side brother I will ask. Are you understood this boss? Three, three questions I asked. Either the person is a Trump is your own brother or cousin brother or in-law side brother. Are you understood the person? If anywhere in this topic, if the statement use the word brother, sister, sibling, we have to assume own brother, own sister or own sibling only. If it is related to cousin side statement specifically mentioned, if it is related to in-law side statement specifically mentioned, all are understood this word. We have to assume what? A own brother or own sibling only. Getting this? Getting this? Right. The last thing. Spouse. What is the exact gender of spouse? Angie? We don't know. This That depends upon who is saying. That means that this is called neutral gender. This relation is called what? Neutral gender. That means we are unable to find male or female. Getting this, boss? It depends upon the statement. If I am saying my spouse is, a, so my, for example, uh, whom I can say? Ah, my favorite person, Parnidhi Chopra. So Parnidhi Chopra is my his spouse. What is it? Then what is the gender of Parnidhi Chopra? You know it. Are you understood this, boss? Now, listen. Sibling. Tell me what is the gender of sibling exactly? We don't know. Understood this, boss? Tell me, what is the exact gender of cousin? We don't know. So, these three are called neutral. All are understood this, boss? So, before starting this topic, you have to remember this assumption or conditions. Understood this? All are understand this? So what is the first assumption or condition? Don't decide the gender based upon the name in any topic since he said. What second? Couples means they must be married. Then only you call them as a couple. Why am I saying like that? Some student asked, there are three married couples, question says. One student asked me, sir, the couple means living together also allowed. I jumped from the building. That is why I am generalizing. Are you understood this part? So couples means they must be married. Next they must be male and female only. Next. Husband must be elder than the wife. Next. You see how I, how I made the line. You see. Yeah. First I made them husband and wife. Then I made them what? Father, mother. Then I made right, right wrote like that. Do you understand? Always read any topics, any subject to teach others. If you read to teach others, you will read differently. Many students will say, uh, so, so they are my students already, now they are teachers in many institutes. Whenever, uh, and they are teaching in online also, this is this YouTube, what, current affairs and everything. At the time, I will say to them, read a newspaper, read a newspaper daily. Never read that. Understood? Never. Now they are the most popular teacher than me also. If you ask them, they will answer any question. But I only know at the time who they are. Why? They read the same subject there, same book there. Now also they will read the same book. Now why they are different? Because at that time they read for themselves. Now they are reading to teach others. They will read the same line different. Are you understood? this? Whatever the subject, read to teach others. You will ask a different question. You will never forget easily. 
Understand this, boss? Right. Now, husband side or wife. If husband is elder than the wife, we have to assume. Okay, boss? If wife is elder, statement specifically mentioned. What is next? Husband side or wife side not mentioned, what do you have to assume? Irrespective of you are male or female. If it is related to what? To wife side, statement specifically mentioned. Get in this? Heading this. Next. Father side, mother side not mentioned in the statement. What do you have to assume? Father said, irrespective of whatever your gender. Next. If male or female not mentioned in the statement, what do you have to assume? Male means I will hang in the camera, write your name. Uh, cannot be determined. Are you understood or not understood? this? Will I understand this part? Always be happy. The more you happy, the more you can ask the question. Understood? Don't do like this. Then do whatever you want to murder. Like that, don't say it. Understood? Yes, boss. The more you happy, the more you can ask the doubt. Okay, boss? Right, next. Yes, if somebody having kid, that kid must be biological kid of that person. All I understand this. And the parent must be married. So then we need information related to that person's partner. What information you will search from the paragraph? Divorced or not? Died or not? Widow or widower is mentioned or not? Are you understood or not understood? Nothing is mentioned, what do you have to assume? They are married. Eh? <laughs> if nothing is mentioned in the question, we have to assume the person is alive and we don't have the sufficient information. Are you understood or not understood? Next. Anji, brother, sister, sibling means what do you have to assume? Own brother, own sister, own sibling only. Next. Neutral gender. What are those neutral gender? Spouse, sibling, cousin. All are getting this one. All are getting this. Anybody want to ask anything? Anybody? Next. Whom we can consider as a same generation people. I'm not asking same age people. More or less same. That is called the same generation. Whom we can consider as a same generation people. Sibling, right then. Acha. Friends, right? Acha. You know the friend of Tata? Can you say both are same generation people? No. Yes. Only cousin. I can't say. Grandparents, grandparents, we are same generation people. Madam Ji, can I ask them, can you go for taking Kingfisher with them? No, they will beat us. Listen, boss. <clears throat> Partners, uh, sibling. They are only considered as what? Same generation people. Understood this? Sir, sibling means whose sibling I can treat as a same generation people. Own sibling? Me and my own sibling are same generation or not? Yes. My cousin sibling and me are same generation or not? I'm not saying same age. More or less same. Understood this, boss? Then, my in-laws, that means brother-in-law, sister-in-law. Are you understood this, boss? Or we are in same generation or not? Are you understand this, boss? Right. Whose partner? My, my grandfather's partner and me are same generation. No. Understood this one. My uncle's partner and me are same generation. No. Then whose partner are in same generation? My own partner and me are in same generation. We have to write in the same hierarchy. My cousin's partner, same generation. My cousin and cousin partner are same generation. Me and cousin are same generation. Me and cousin partner are also same generation. Are you understood what I am saying, boss? And in-law side partner also same generation. My sister-in-law's husband. Who is my sister-in-law? Anji? First you have to ask, what is the gender of you? Okay, right. I am male. My brother's, my brother's wife. Tell me. Who is my brother's wife if I am male? Anji? What I said? I also forgot. Brother-in-law brother I said, ah. Right, okay. My brother-in-law. That means my sister's husband. Me and my sister are in same generation. My sister and sister husband are in same generation. That means me and sister husband are in same generation. Are you understood or not? They must be in the same hierarchy. Either your own sibling or cousin sibling or in-law side sibling. Are you getting this? Boss? Because some students don't know which hierarchy we have to write it. 
Now let's see. For example, A is uncle of B. Statement says, for example, so A and B are there. What is the relationship here between uncle? Now tell me, can I write A and B in same generation? No. Are you understand? Who is in higher hierarchy? Who is the uncle here? Who is the uncle? A is the uncle. So yeah, whoever in higher hierarchy. So A is the uncle of whom? B. Uncle means male or female? Somebody thinking. <laughs> so generally male means plus. Female means what? Minus. So you can you see the book. Somebody they will write different sign also whatever it is. But generally we will use like this. Are you understand this? What is gender of B? We don't know. Are you understand this person? C is a grandmother of D. So C and D is there. In between, what is the relation? Can I write C and D in same hierarchy? No. Then how can I write it? So who is the grandmother? C. So C is the grandmother. Male or female? Female. Can I, which side grandmother? Not given. What you have to assume? Father side. Okay, Abba. So can I write D here? Why? If I write here, then D becomes kid of C. Grandchildren must be what? Lowest in the hierarchy? Next, I will write the hierarchy. Don't worry. That means, so I cannot write it here. That means I have to write. Are you understood? Allah understand? Allah are getting this? So whom you can write it as a same generation people, you have to remember this. Allah are getting this? One more thing I have. A is brother of B. Who is uncle of B? A is brother of B. And is uncle of B. In some question, the statement is coming like this. Are you ready? Somebody don't know how to decode it. Allah ready of us? Now listen. Here one statement. Here another statement. And what is the connector here? Who is the connector? Now tell me. A is the brother of B. What is gender of A? Male. What is gender of B? We don't know. Right. Next statement. He is the uncle of D. So this who belongs to A, this who belongs to B. Are you understood what I am saying? Tell me. If the connector is who or whom is given, that belongs to immediate previous statement object. This is the subject in the statement, this object in the statement. Are you understood what I am saying, boss? Now come to here. A is the brother of B and is the uncle of D. Who is the uncle of D? Here the connector is and is there. If the connector is and is given or is is given, that related to immediate previous statement is subjected that is given. Are you understood? Yes, please. Yes, no, cannot be determined. Understand? From this statement, we don't know B. From this statement, who is the uncle of D? B. Now B becomes male. For this statement, the gender of B not given. But if B comes in this statement, we know the gender of are you understand? If male or female is not given, don't assume any particular gender. Understood this? Right. Any, anybody doubt? If the connector is given who or whom, that belongs to previous statement, what? Object or subject? Object. If the connector is and is given or is is given, it belongs to what? Subject. Are you understood this? Was? Allah understand? Anybody doubt so far? Anybody? Right. Now come to the top. You see how this topic performed in the past. Every you see here, you see here, 2024, not a single question from this. But you see one year how many questions they ask. Getting this first? Are getting? Right. Now we can start the topic. Whatever I said so far, that is not the topic. Ready? 
blood relation. First type of question that is family tree based questions. Two types of question in this. One is simple family tree based question and another is complex family tree based questions. What is called a simple? What is called a complex in this? Don't say, sir, nuclear family means simple, joint family is complex, not like that. Understood this first. What is simple family tree based question? What is complex family tree based questions? Are you ready? If you, some paragraph is given information, they are name is that person name is rather than that. If they discussed only relation, then it belongs to simple. Other than the relation, <coughs> some other variable also discussed. That means their profession, their preference, it becomes a complex. Are you understood this, boss? If other than the name, if they discussed only relation in that uh, information, then it is said to be simple family tree. Other than the relation, plus some other variable, then it belongs to what a complex. Are you understanding? Sir, what is this? I am not understand what you are saying. You will ask, you will say like that. You see. You read the three, this four line. You yourself read. This four line. Then, other than the person name, what they are discussing? Relation. That means a, a grandson, mother-in-law, brother, nephew, sister-in-law, son. Like that only? This is the example for simple. Simple family tree based question. You go through this paragraph. Only paragraph. Tell me, it belongs to simple or complex, sir? Sir, it is a lengthy paragraph, sir, so complex. No, why complex? Sir? Because other than relation, they are discussing about what also? Profession, other variable, it belongs to complex. So far, UPSC asked a question from simple also, complex also. Allah understood this question. In your family hierarchy, who is in the topmost in the hierarchy? I asked in one batch in Bangalore branch sometime, some years back. One student says, sir, my wife is in the topmost hierarchy. I'm not asking about a personal thing. So generally, who is in the topmost hierarchy? Grandparents. And I saw this boss. So ra rarely great grandparents is possible. So they must be higher than this. If our grandparents having any sibling, they are also in the same hierarchy. Are you understood what I am saying? Who is the next in the hierarchy? Anji? Parents. Anji. If our parents having any sibling, they are also in the same hierarchy. If grandparents sibling having any kid, they must be in this hierarchy. Are you understood this question? Who is the last hierarchy? Uh, so kids, your generation people, for example. Understood. If parents are sibling having any kids, they are also in the same hierarchy. Generally, how many hierarchy are there? Three. Rarely great, great grandparents are also possible. But we never allow these people to survive. How they will survive? Understood this one. So generally, this is the three hierarchy. Are you understand this boss? And in the hierarchy, they are in the highest in the hierarchy. They must be eldest in the generation. They are the eldest in the generation, in the family. Are you understand? They are in the lowest in the hierarchy. They are the what? Youngest in the generation. I am saying youngest generation. Are you understand this, boss? Now tell me. Is the grandparents are married or not married? Are you? Are? Grandparents married or not married? How do you know that? If they are not married, how they become our grandparents? Understood? Right. So, grandparents, sibling. These people married or not married? May or may not be. 
we don't have sufficient information are you understand this parents married or not married don't think western culture relation understood this so parents married or not married they must be married parents sibling may or may not be we don't know. tell me this generation married or not married how do you know may or may not be maybe they married they are not created the next generation may or may not be. are you understood this class so generally three hierarchy are are you understand this all are understand this right next second type of question upsc asked question from here upsc asked question from here also next type of question is coded relation we will solve all the question don't worry ready what is coded relation that means they are not conveying the relation directly then how they are conveying relation silently by i something how they will convey they will convey indirectly are you fine are you in hangover right now so then how they are conveying the relation indirectly how they convey the relation indirectly they will use some number some letter some symbol they will say this means this relation for that question only understood this all are understand they will use some numbers or some symbol or some letters okay they will say this means this relation are you understand sir what is the meaning of that for example not always for example i am writing minus is coded as sister in law oh sorry sir i i, I somebody will fire angry on me so minus is coded as wife okay but don't take a double meaning lesson so plus is coded as sister in law sorry, don't take a double meaning lesson not all this for example two is coded as uncle a is coded as sister like this dollar is coded as mother it may be anything are you understand but which is symbol which is relation you cannot decide it question will be decided and that is applicable for that question only after that you have to forget it are you understand this boss three types of question in this one is forward order next type of question reverse order what is forward reverse next slide i will teach next is forward some are forward some are reverse sir what is this you will ask like that listen now okay a is brother of b oh i a plus b means a is brother of b statement says listen a plus b means b is brother of b the statement says whenever i am teaching this coded relation many students they will not uh, they will not concentrate properly are yaar i know this once question comes every option will expose them so concentrate properly especially coded relation are i know if you are sitting in the class first to forget who you are in next 10 to 15 classes i will demolish your entire ego then you if you ask what is your qualification you will never say understood is so concentrate properly listen the statement says like that now what is the symbol between a and b code what is the relationship between a and b that means in this example plus c is called brother are you understand this plus c is coded as brother are you understand this boss now am i going to brother means same generation or not so i am going to write a and b in the same hierarchy so i am writing a and b in the same hierarchy are you understood up to here now who is the brother i can read from left to right i have this i will write like this i will read i will read the statement from left to right or i can read the statement from right to left are you understand in which direction i can read you cannot decide question will say are you understand who is the brother 
start reading from a ended at b now tell me you are going to read from left to right or right to left that means this is example for forward are you understood or not all are understand who is the brother so i know the gender of a what is the exact gender of b we don't know that means male or female all are understood this come to you what is the code is given here i will change the code somebody will ask sir why is there the same thing now tell me multiply is coded as brother so between b and a what is the relation is given brother that means same generation or not yes sir. so b and a are in same generation are you understand who is the brother i have to read from left to right or right to left i will ask like that tell me what i have read who is the brother b so start reading from b and ended at a are you understood or not understand start reading from b and ended at a that means you are reading from left to right or right to left or? i understand so what i said here this is forward na a to b forward right here i am going to read don't write like here i understand why there is a confusion sir now i will write now so remove the symbol plus right relation so i can read from left to right or i read from right to left are you understand this who is the brother he start reading from a ended at b so i am going to read from left to right or right to left or that means this is example for forward come to here remove the symbol and write the relation what is the relation brother so i can read from left to right or i can read from right to left also are you understand tell me who is the brother start reading from b and ended at a that means i am going to read from left to right or right to left or that means this is the example for what reverse order are you understood or not understood who is the brother here what is gender of b mean what is the gender of a we don't know all are understood or not understood. if you are reading from left to right forward if you are reading from right to left that is what reverse are you understood this boss i will show the example tell me is it forward or reverse or like this tell me first information plus is coded as what brother forward forward or reverse forward second information forward or reverse forward third this is the example for what forward are you understood or not understood all are understand next level tell me what is the first information forward or reverse reverse second reverse third third information reverse fourth information all are reverse this is the example for what reverse order are you understood or not understood this next you see the example tell me first forward second reverse that means some information are forward some information are what reverse order all are understood now you understand three type of question one is a forward second is what reverse next is what sir how one information is forward or reverse also it is not one information it is not within it. one information forward another information reverse like that only are you understood or not so far upsc asked question from so far upsc asked question from forward only not a single question from reverse order not a single question from forward also reverse also so in future we have to ready in this type of question understood this boss all are understand getting this all are getting this boss yes sir now tell me percentage is coded as what Uh, one minute madam yes percentage is called as wife okay boss so who is the wife yes is the wife so start reading from yes ended at t so you are going to read from left to right or right to left that means this is example for forward so you see here undiscoded as what what relation dotted in understand this 
so i can read left to right also right to left also so who is the daughter in law t start reading from t ended at start reading from t ended at maybe i typed in the night time is correct yes yes so forward or reverse forward are you understand all are understand anybody doubt in forward reverse while solving the question don't say sir can you repeat one more time understood this boss anybody doubt anybody first type of question is family tree based question second type of question is coded relation third type of question is getting this all right now tell me in this dollar is called as what elder who is elder start reading from yes ended at t understood this are you remember i told you in this topic 99.99% you will not see the number but you see the one example i am showing here you see this are you understand not understand but compared to any topics rarely they will use the number when you see here well are you understand this class so third next type of question let's understand this third type of question is a indirect relation sir what is called indirect relation you will ask like that don't think illegal that is different meaning illegal relation is different don't think in that way indirect means they are not conveying the relation directly okay sir ji are they going to use some number some letter some symbol no sir how they will convey the relation then you will ask like that are you understand listen okay for example mother's husband my mother's husband sister's son are you understand who is this person that person is uh, my mother's husband sister's son you will you will ask sir are you hangover or not you have to say what is the relation directly what is this you are saying i am not understand what is the relation between you and the person are you understood this boss listen now okay first what you have to do identify the indirect relation now this is indirect relation mother's husband who is that fellow don't bring western culture relation father okay but father's sister who is that person are father sister auntie auntie's son cousin that means that person is cousin instead of saying directly the cousin the statement use the statement like indirectly they are cut are you understood this all are you understand first you have to identify which is indirect relation then first convert to indirect into direct relation then read the statement and solve the question are you understand this boss right next fourth type of question in this topic is sir arrangement based question that means not only relation is given not only profession or something is given they will give they can they are sitting in either in linear or in circle i apologize or in closed arrangement closed may be circular may be rectangle may be square or any polygon is possible are you understand this boss all are understand this boss so this type of question so far not asked in blood relation this we will teach i will solve only one question one topic in logical and analytical reasoning puzzle i will teach you that is what is but i will solve only one question so how it is the questions look like are you understood this boss next type of question is data sufficiency question you know what is data sufficiency question okay boss some statement is there for example statement 1 statement 2 statement three, like this statement 1 and they will ask some question statement 1 alone sufficient to answer the question or not statement 2 alone sufficient to answer the question or not this type of question asked in are you remember this in the beginning of topic i wrote here three stages they asked a question like this here but what they asking now statement using statement 135 can we able to answer the question or not? 
that is nowadays are you understood this course we will see later so are you we will see example also how is data sufficiency question to solve and everything the last type of question is which is correct or in most popular nowadays are you understand the statement you information is given okay but which of the following are not true tommy sir is a by friend of parinidhi option a option b okay but trump and swami sir are sibling option c then you have to know that which is correct or wrong not outside information using the parent are you understood this well? are you understand this that's all introduction of this talk understood this all are understand all are, what are types of questions what are the types of questions in this topic family tree based question order is very important first i have to take the glass then ice then upper then upper order is there are you understood this boss right tell me order tell me the order family tree based question how many type are? what are those two type and is simple and what is simple only relation what is complex relation plus some other variable are you understand this generally how many hierarchy three hierarchy great grandparents are rarely possible okay next type of question coded relation how many type what are those three type forward reverse forward and reverse next type of question somebody thinking if i am saying one number this is a parinidhi chopra number at any cost you will remember and, and, and you are able to what uh, register in your mind if i am saying you people are not registering in the mind so okay what is next type of question indirect relation you know that what is next type of question arrangement linear or sir what is this so i will show you one example what is linear arrangement based questions are are this many question i have to solve this it is the first line understood what i am saying what is this fitting in a circle in puzzle topic not all are facing towards the center some are facing the center some are facing outside of the center are you understand this boss so all the properties and everything i will teach you more clearly in uh, puzzle topic understood this boss you understand what is that arrangement based question is it linear mean straight line what is the difference between straight line and circle i will teach in uh, puzzle topic also i will teach in permutation combination also if you are going to arrange them in linear what is every every places are same or different if you are arrange them in circular every city same or different okay but that we will teach more more uh, refined thing in permutation combination understood this anybody doubt anybody then what's next type of question and the data sufficiency next e correct or incorrect that's all about this topic now you see what they asking so far here like 2011 to 14 they started asking from family tree family tree based questions Le 15 to family tree based question also they asked plus sir data sufficiency they ask understood this some questions belongs to correct or incorrect also now you know that combination of the statement they are asking understood this boss that's all introduction of this stuff anybody doubt can we start attacking the question anybody doubt so far anybody want to ask anything any am aadmi no anything you want to ask anybody 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 boss back side why you always silent acha acha so already can you attack the question now right one question i will solve next question also i will solve they will see. and i typed this you see this the relation i typed all this here sir can i mug up all this thing no need of mug up while solving the question you know that all the relation understood in that right one sample question i will solve next question i will make you to solve ready ready abbas listen what are the questions i am shooting while reading the state 
okay boss i told you in the introduction class itself question is very important than answering the question are you understand this totally silent if you see uh, last 10 days uh, now the, everybody starting the batch for csat and everybody making reels i never made reels in my life okay boss so i put the class video we will put that and they are solving the time and work question this many men can finish the work in 5k days upsc question this many men can finish is 6k this many men can finish the work in 5k days now how much percent changes in the men that is asked in the question understood this boss the, you see that leave how to solve because everybody can solve understood first how they read the question they never read it. here they are discussing about men and days using men and days we can derive the total work total work is called product how can you derive the total work men into days this is called product they are doing the same work they are this group also doing the same work this question eligible to solve by product constant rule two method one is ratio another is percentage we are going to solve by seven to eight method but first you have to know which method is most suitable are you understood this boss so learn how to read the question question will speak to you i am having this much information if you approach me in this way i will provide the quickest solution understood or not understood if you are not reading the question properly the way you want to read it you will say question is difficult you will say cat level you will say upsc made difficult level are you understood this boss yes so all are ready listen boss ready boss right tell first line first line a is the so a is the father of c can i write a and c in the same generation no no who is the father a so a a is the father of c are you understand up to here what is gender of c so far we don't further read but c is not there then who is c daughter all are understood here tell me so far see married or not married we don't know a is married or not married how do you know having kid so that person must be married all are understood this next statement e is the daughter of c tell me can i write e and c are in same generation no so who is the daughter who is the daughter e somebody is saying c i will jump from the building so who is the daughter e is the daughter can i write e below c or above c below c so e is the daughter of now tell me e is married or not married anji e answer my question don't be like other common people if you see the tv debate or anything anywhere if you ask one question up to half an hour they never answer the question are you understood or not understood this one so listen the question proper understand this part sometimes whenever i feel boring what i will do my my entertainment is watch the interview class of the students after mains they will go for interview i will watch that some i will laugh like that what they will ask what they reply some of the students topper also understood this one please be a good listener that is very very important understand forgot your qualification that is another very very important otherwise your mind will never allow to listen others so detach who you are understood this boss right now tell me he is married or not married we don't know don't say not married how do you know why you are punishing he tell me <laughs> so he is married or not married we don't know she is married or not married how do you know she is married she is having the kid all are understood this boss next statement f is the spouse of a now tell me f and a same generation or not yes so f is the spouse of a are you understand this what is gender of f huh f is the spouse spouse means gender we don't know but f is the spouse of a a is gender you know already so what is gender of f yes very careful otherwise fringe groups are waiting outside they will beat you understood this boss next statement b is the brother so b and c are same generation or not yes sir. so b is the brother of c b is male next statement 
D is the son of B. So D and B are same generation. No, who is the son? D. Can I write D below B or above B or with B? Or? Below B. What is the gender of D? Male. Why? Son. Is D is married or not married? We don't know. Somebody saying married. B is married or not married? Married. Are you understood this boss? Next. G is the spouse. That means G and B are same generation or not? Yes. Sir. So G is the spouse of B. What is gender of B? G now? Female. Are you understood this boss? Next statement. H is the father of G. Can I write H and G in same generation? No. Can I write H below G? Anji? Somebody saying yes. Sir. No. Where I have to write that? Sometimes I forgot the topic, the way some students are replying. Understand this first. Other understand? Now tell me. Is H is married or not married? H is married or not married? Married. I need partner for H. So I am seeing the information related to H partner. Tell me any information? No, that means we have to assume H partner is alive. We don't have sufficient information. Sir, what is the use of this? It's a waste of the time. You will ask like that. Question asked like this. Who got divorced? You will say, H may be divorced. Who is widower? You will say, then H may be widower. Whose partner died? You will say, H partner may be died. To avoid that thing only. Are you understand? Tell me. She is married or not married? Married. Tell me, what, any information related to C's partner in the information? Anji? No. What I have to assume? Alive, but we don't have sufficient information. All are understood this. Anybody doubt? All are understand this, boss. How you demolish the question, you will get the answer. All are understand. Now tell what is the first question? Who is the son in law of H? Who is the son in law of H? Anji? Person B. Who is the granddaughter of A? Yes, granddaughter. Whom? E. Who is the common grandchild of F and H? For F, who are the grandchildren? For F. For F, who are the grandchildren? D and E. For H, who is the grandchildren? D. Who is the common grandchildren between these two? That is the answer. Are you understand? This is the example for simple or complex. Sir, only three lines, four lines. Sir. So simple. Why simple? Yes, all are understood. In this question, there is no problem in drawing the diagram. Okay, boss. All are ready? We will see who you are. Try this question. Read the way you need to read. Inside you have to read. Don't read loudly, then it will disturb others. Not only read, you have to feel what you read. You will face some doubt. I'm waiting for your doubt. Somebody already prepares that doubt. Sir, I don't know how to draw the diagram. Where to start the diagram? Anybody face like this? Sir, every, every information I have to draw separately. Unable to connect. Anybody face like that? Faced. Any other person faced? Right. 
somebody not writing anything anyway swami sir will solve everything i understand all ready okay can i say something or you, i can i wait can i say right all ready listen carefully in two ways you can draw the diagram either you can every information you can draw separately then later on any connecting to connecting point comes connect that but uh, you, one or two uh, two diagram then you will feel boring are yaar what is this are you understand listen now carefully where to start come to here here first information discuss about whom a and d. mentally i'm while reading i mentally draw diagram for a and c next i need information related to a or c to connect to the previous diagram next information discuss about what a r c r c also there i am able to connect it i can start drawing the diagram with a and c understood not understand yes. all are understand come to here come here first information discuss about second line first information discuss about whom a and a and h i am mentally i am drawing diagram for a and h next i need information related to either a or h or a and h next information discuss about whom a or h no i cannot start drawing the diagram with a and h understood not understood next information discuss about whom i am ready to draw diagram for g and c g and c yeah yes sir so next i need information related to either g or c to connect with the diagram next information discuss about g or c or both so i cannot start drawing the diagram with g and c understood not understood next information discuss about whom d and e i am a mentally draw the diagram next i need information related to either d or e or both next information discuss about whom e i am able to connect it my starting point for the diagram is with the d and e understood not at all all are understood this bar now read d and e are sorry brother means sir own brother cousin brother you know which brother own brother understand same same generation or different generation so what is the gender of d and e are you understood this so far next information discuss about what b is the only so i have to define nephew now whom we call nephew brother son is what a nephew right then sister son is nephew then Uh, wife wife after that not coming after that what my brother in law son is also nephew my sister in law son also nephew that means sibling son is nephew own sibling cousin sibling in law side sibling your sibling son is what a nephew now you understand nephew means male or female uh, we don't know means i will jump from the building nephew means male understood my siblings siblings daughter how can you name them niece are you understand niece means male or female female understand sibling means own cousin in law side anything are you understood or not understood this part now tell me here who is the nephew how danger people everybody who is the nephew b is a nephew are you understand it who is calling b as nephew e is calling a sir sir e is calling a, a, a b as what a nephew what is gender of e uh, you know already male my nephew is b whom we call nephew siblings son so far who wording is very important so far who is the sibling of uh, of e so d is son is whom are you understood not understood acha who is who is nephew here b who is calling b as nephew e i am e my nephew is b who my call nephew my sibling son is b so far who is sibling of e who is sibling of e okay, so d son is b somebody may ask sir for e other than d some other sibling also possible you will say like that that is why i am using the word so far who is the sibling of e? you further information saying some other person also sibling of e we have read our diagram all are understood or not understood 
All are understood. Ask whatever you want to ask. Understood? But no double meaning. Okay, first yes. Right. Next. Is D having another son possible? D having another son possible? Why? Only nephew. That means my sibling having only one son. So B D having daughter possible? Yes. Possible. Word is very important. Possible. Are you understood this boss? Anybody doubt? Anybody? Next information. F is there. F is the sister-in-law. Who is the sister-in-law? F. F. Whom we get? So who is calling F a sister-in-law? D call F a sister-in-law. What is gender of D? Male. I am male. My sister-in-law. Whom I call sister-in-law? My brother's wife. So far, who is the brother of D? His partner is whom? Yes. Anybody doubt? So far. Anybody doubt? Anybody? Any Amadmi? Anybody? Next statement. B is the? You know already B is already son of whom? D. Now B is also son of whom? What does it mean? Anji? They are partner. That means who is partner? Anji? D and a? C. Tell me what gender of C? Anybody doubts? Are you understand this? Come to second law. G is the mother-in-law of C. Are you understand this? Understand? Now tell me. G, who is mother-in-law? What is gender of G? Female. So what is gender of C? Now we know. Earlier we don't know. Now I am C. I am female. My mother-in-law. Who is my mother-in-law? My mother-in-law. I am female. My husband, Mataji. Are you understood this bar? Other understand. Who is my husband? D. D is Mataji is whom? Anji? D. Are you understood or not understood this bar? So what is gender of G? Female. You know D and E are sibling? So G having two kids so far. Are you understood or not understood? Anybody doubt? No bar. Achha. Next previous statement. Read. Tell me how many. Read the first line. There are. I apologize. I am not reading that thing. There are three married couple means how many male, how many female? Three male. In how many generation? I already created how many generation? Three. One, two, three generation I created. Are you understood this? Now read. A is the grandson of H. A must be which hierarchy? This hierarchy. Are you understand? Can I write A here? A is the grandson. Why? Anji? Only nephew. I cannot write like this. Uh, a is going to kid of this side. Are you understood or not understood? Who is H? Grandparents. So can I write H in this hierarchy? In this hierarchy? In this hierarchy. Now tell me. Can I write H here? Why? Yes? You understand what they are saying? Give the statement using the word like that. There are three married couple, one statement. There are only three married couple, another statement. What is the difference between those two? Three married couple means more than three also possible. All are understood this, boss? Uh, one reason you cannot write like that. Second thing, A is the grandson of H. So A is the grandchildren. And H must be grandparents. Father side or mother side. Not to mention, we have to assume whose side Yes, father side parent must be H. If I write here H, yes, father side is not there. I cannot write here. All are understood and not understood. Can I write here H? Why? It becomes mother side. Are you understood this bar? So no other choice. I have to write here. Are you understood this bar? What is gender of H? Male. All are understood and not understood. All are understood what I am saying? Tell me. What is asked in the first question? Extraordinarily. You people are rereading the question. I may ask you to reread the question. I asked what is asked in the question. Relation between? Very good. I will hang in the fact. What is the relation between me and Parnidhi Chopra? No relation. Who is that person? Danger person? Yes, sir. 
Listen now carefully. That means two answer possible. How Parnidhi calls me one answer, how I call Parnidhi another answer. All are understood what I am saying, but now tell me what is asked in the question. How is how is B related? How is Swami sir related to Parnidhi? That means how Parnidhi calls Swami sir. Some student immediately said grandfather. Listen, Gary. That means <laughs> how H call B is asked in the question. All are understood or not understand. Either how B call H is must be an option. All are understood this boss. Tell me how H call B. How H call B? Grandson. All are understood this what I am asking. Tell me what is asked in the next question. How? How? G call F. Are you understood this boss? Tell me how G call F. Daughter in law. Are you understand this? Who is the uncle of ye? Anji? Who is the uncle of ye? D. D. Right. Next. How many female are there in the family? Three. One, two, three. You know already this thing? One question. Next slide. Uh, yes. Tell me the answer. How is G's grandson related to A's mother. So can you rather show the diagram? Oh, achha. Oh, sorry. Anji, answer. Why? Wait, are you understood? This one? If one one answers are there, we will see now. Tell me who is a grandson, A's grandson? Who is, sorry, G's grandson? G's grandson is what? A and B or B and E? Okay, but so A and what? Both are men. Who is A's mother? F. Now what is asked in the question? Tell me. The question asks how F call A, how F call B. That is asked in the question. How F call A? How F call A? Son. One answer is son. How F call B? How F call B? Husband, husband, brother is brother-in-law. Brother-in-law, son is nephew. That means a nephew here. So my answer is uh, for this question, son or nephew in the same option. Is it there? No. That means your answer must be what? Eh? Listen, I'm changing my option. If the question is like this. A is son. B is mother. C is uh, sister-in-law. D is uncle. Now tell me, at the time, what is the answer? At the time, son is the answer. Are you understood or not understand? If the option says like this, A is nephew and B is sister, uh, C is father and D is, uh, for example, uncle. At the time, what is the answer? Nephew. I am changing the option. A is son, B is nephew, C is sister, D is none of this. None of this answer. Are you understood or not understood? All are understood. What are you? This all the thing, yeah? Or this? So, who is G's grandson? A and B. Who is A's mother? That is it. What is asked in the question? How F call A? How F call B? Are you understand? Now tell me, how you have called ye? One minute. How you have called ye? Son. Very good. So I am writing here, you have called ye, yes, son. How you have called B? You see, how you have called B? You have husband, husband, brother. That means brother-in-law. Brother-in-law's son must be nephew. 
Are you understood this first? That means F call A and B as son or nephew. Are you understood this part? So we need in one option because here two person are there. So F call these two person differently. So son or nephew. Some student will say, sir, nephew also son. Somebody will say like this. Are you, that is why I am writing separately. Are, are you understand? So F call one person as son, F call another person as what? Nephew. So, answer for this question in the same option has to be son or nephew. But uh, it is written separately. So, I cannot, so how can I say definitely son only? How can I say definitely nephew only? That's why it cannot be determined. Understood or not? Any doubt? Anybody? They are totally silent. Eh? Understood or not understand this? Right. Now, solve this question. This person. But I will I will ask you the way I want to ask the question. I will not leave you. This is the answer means next question. No. Allow the mind to read the question. And one more point is that somebody they will read from top to bottom. Bad habit. One statement, interpret. Next statement, interpret. Otherwise, again, you have to read step by step. And one more point I have to say, please listen. In our family, if somebody died, what we will do? First, we will remove that person name from the voter ID card, ration card. We will remove everybody. Why I am saying like that? What is the second line? Uh, G is here. We do. What is gender of G? Female. That means, uh, what about G's partner? Died. Somebody may think uh, G's partner in this list. If somebody died, that person is out of the list. All are understood and not. All are understood what I am saying, boss? All right, now sir. Yes, it belongs to simple of uh, complex. Sir. So very difficult to read, sir. So complex, sir. and not like that. Understood this? Right. If you are not breaking the statement, then you don't know what to do. Ready for the question? Yeah, boss. Yes. Finished. Done. We will see. Online people, anybody doubt? Eh? Nobody asking the doubt. I think some people already attended this topic. Eh? Don't exit some extra question I added. Yes. Are you ready for my question? Tell me what is the gender of E? How do you decide the gender of E is a female? What some students saying? What is related to whom the question asked? E. E is wife of F, E becomes female. E is grandmother of E, E becomes a female. E is anti of C, E becomes a female. How many have you done like this? But if I write like this in terms of male, you finished. Understand? I understand. Now tell me, how do you decide gender of E? Yes. And Angie. Wife of F. Why you are attaching E with F? Why not with other people? Oh, achha, we will see. Any other? How do you decide E is gender? 
yes yes i am waiting for this wrong answer ah uh, yes i am waiting for this wrong answer somebody will say sir i placed everybody that means out of seven people i placed in the diagram six people left out is e three female are there already two female i made that so left out is e so e is a female but now tell me what is the after you draw the diagram what is the gender of b c d we don't know they also female possible are you understood and not understood all are understand what logically you do wrong i know that answer so that is why wait for the question understood this are ready all are listen boss now your joint family consists of how many member seven out of this how many female three female and four anybody doubt after here g is your widow what is gender of g female what happened to partner right who is that partner we don't know are you understood up to here right over here who is the sister in law and the sister in law next statement is there but the connector is what and that belongs to what subject that means g is sister in law of t is father yeah now tell me what is the gender of g female what is gender of f how do you know father now tell me who is sister in law in this statement who is calling g as a sister in law f f is male or female i am f my sister in law is g whom i call sister in law my brother's wife my my means whom here f who is so far f brother this person is died that means f brother's wife is g that means f must be here. are you understood or not understood yes can i explain one more time madam ji louder d is father the sister in law of whom f who is f f is d is father D's father, you read it. D's father is F. Do you understand this? All are understood or not understood? Are you understand? My brother's wife is G. Ah, G's husband brother is F. All are understood or not understood? This person. All are getting this? Getting this? Right over. Next. Say so what is gender of F? Male. You know already. So D's father is F. What is gender of D? we don't know next statement b and d are sibling means cousin or in law side or own own all are remember that so b both are sibling what is gender of b we don't know so far are you understand this next statement a is the daughter of b a is the daughter of b what is gender of a b now tell me a is married or not married we don't know b is married or not married at any cost we have to find who is the partner of b understand national important issue next d is married or not married we don't know are you understood or not understood f is married or not married married we need some person to attach with f are you understand this next c is the cousin whom we call cousin uncle or auntie's kid is cousin and who is cousin here who is calling c as cousin i am b my cousin is c means my uncle or auntie's kid is c me means b who is b's uncle or auntie g so g's kid must be are you understand understand that's all information are finished how many people you have to arrange initially seven people out of seven how many people you placed six people who is missing e what is gender of e we don't know are you understood or not understood but i understand this listen now carefully but based upon this statement you know e is a female but if it is in terms of male is given then how can you solve that only i am thinking are you understand this now e is there can i attach e with a can i attach e with a as a partner as a kid as a relative 
we don't know e and a having any relation or not so if i attach e with a everything is uncertainty are you understood or not understood so i cannot attach e with a anybody doubt anybody can i attach e with d if i attach e with d any relation it must be uncertainty can i attach e with c we don't know may or may not be. now we know already b is searching one partner we need one person to attach b because b is alone painful person so we need to attach one person with f also now i can attach e with b or i can attach e with f only if i attach e with b are you understand this what will happen tell me if i attach b with e so e is wife of f correct no e is grandmother of e correct no e is auntie of c correct that means that answer is none of this not so i cannot attach e with e are you understood or not uh, sir based upon this i know e is a female so now i know the gender of e is a female can i attach e with b e becomes a female b becomes a male can i attach this why then that answer is not so without knowing e also you cannot attach e with b after knowing e's gender also you cannot attach e with b are you understood or not understood this now where i have to attach then f only i have to attach are you understand this all are understand now three female over so rest everybody male now tell me e is wife of f correct or wrong so e is grandmother of a correct or wrong yes e is auntie of wrong yes now answer is are you understood or not yes please acha then but you see that verify only seven members are are you understand that three female four male it may be more than three female possible four more than four possible that means it may be more than seven people possible but only seven members are given in the question says you see that is why i am saying na three female okay you are saying like that that means we cannot answer the question are you understood this right any other any other any other all are understood what i am saying all are understand this now is it simple or complex sir sir it is simple but it is a complex question all are understood what i am saying anybody doubt so far right we can go to now complex ready all are happy solve this question very easy question don't worry but the way you read how much you are speaking to yourself is very very important allow your mind to read it somebody hand my generation people in the class now visible uh, please, please please so in my classroom you can eat listen you can drink listen anything but ask the doctor but drink means kingfisher not allowed cigarette not allowed ha uh, yes So comfortably eat or drink. I will not ask a share from that. Anybody thinking, sir? You type this question in the daytime or night time? Any mistake is there? Nobody thinking. Actually, let we will see. Maybe I only get doubt. I think. online people no not asking any single doubt are you alive or all are died total how many members given in the statement first line five people two so how many male how many female two female and so total how many people five okay but two female means two wife two female correct now two father means how many male 
Two sun means how many male? Total how many male? But the question says how many male? Sir, daytime or night time you type it. You will ask like that. And so one person having dual role, he is son of somebody. The same person has to be father to somebody. Are you understood or not understood? Can I explain one more time, anybody? I was saying, yes, Acha. Right. Listen. The question says, two are female, three are male, the question says. And the question says, two wife, two son, two father, question says. Okay, boss. Now, listen. Two wife means two female, correct? Two son means two male, two father means two male, total four male. But the question says only three male. That means one person do your role. That means that person, the role of that person is he is the son also, father also. So he is son of somebody, he is father to somebody. That means how many hierarchy I am showing you? That means I have to arrange these five members in three hierarchy. Are you understood? Right? Not understood. Are you understand this? All are understand? All are understand? One more. Any other doubt? Right. One more doubt. One more thing I have to say. How many wife are there? Two wife means how many married couple? Two married couple. How many male, how many female inside? Two male, two female finished. Out of five people, two married couple. Two female, two male finished. You see? Two female, two male finished. Remaining how many person? One person is male or female? That one person male is left out. He is married or not married? We don't know. Are you understood or not? Out of five people, we have to arrange these five people in three hierarchy. And two married couple, two male, two female. That one person male is left out and he is married or not married, we don't know. All are understood. Understand? Understand? Right. What is the first question and answer? Anybody solve? Answer? No? Why? Acha, we will see. Any other? Father, very good wrong answer. Yes. I am expecting somebody will say wife. Very good wrong answer. Yes, I, because you've done the mistake of what is asked in the question. Understand? Yes. So, all are ready? In, anybody having doubts so far, we have to arrange them in three hierarchy? No doubt. Anybody having doubt, two married couple, one male is there, married or not married, we don't know. Anybody doubt in that? Right. All are ready? Now, listen. And bro, don't think, Sir, teacher was the wife means, sir, in the past, teacher, wife, present, who is the wife? Don't ask such questions. Understood this one. Now, listen. Yes, yes. So, teacher was the wife of, one more point I have to say. Listen, boss. Swaminathan don't like cheaters. If Swaminathan don't like cheaters, but Swaminathan may or may not be a cheater. I understand my language. I don't like politician. But Swami Nathan may or may not be a politician. Example saying, don't think, think like that. Are you understand this? All are understood what I am saying, boss. Why I am saying like that? Uh, this day. Understand? I will come to that. So, all are ready? So, teacher was the wife of whom? Doctor. Teacher was the wife of a lawyer. What is gender of lawyer? Me. Who? Character is who? That belongs to whom? Teacher or lawyer? Lawyer, I told you who or who means it belongs to immediately object. Are you remember that? So who belongs to whom here? Lawyer. Lawyer was the wife of? Sorry, lawyer was the son of? Doctor. Are you understood? Not. What is gender of doctor? We don't know. Doctor is married or not married? How do you know doctor is married? So doctor means married. No. How do you know? Because doctor having son as a lawyer. Are you understood? Allah understand? Anybody doubt? Anybody doubt? I need some space open. Anybody doubt? So how many married couples I finished? Two married couple I finished. Out of this, one is male, one is female. How many female over in this? Two female. How many male over? 
two. Remaining how many person is left out? That person is male or female? Male. Married or unmarried? We don't know. Why you are saying definitely unmarried? Are you know? We don't know. So one male is there, married or not married, we don't know. Are you understand? I can place the that male in this hierarchy or in this hierarchy anywhere, here or here, anywhere. Okay, boss. Or in this hierarchy or in this hierarchy. Are you understand this? Are you understand? But in the beginning, I told you, you are going to arrange the five people in how many hierarchy? If I place here only two hierarchy I created, not allowed. If I place here, I created only two hierarchy, not allowed. If I place here, then three hierarchy possible? Or if I place here, then three hierarchy possible? Now tell me, I can place that person here or here. If I place the person, that male is here. Are you understand? Forgot. Are you understand this one? Now tell me, from here, how many fathers are there? From bottom to top. How many fathers are there? You know one person is father? But this person is not married. No, married or not married, we don't know. But how many father has to be there? How many father? So I cannot place that person here. Are you understood? Ah, from here, how you forgot this? From here, how many sons are there? We know this person is one son. And for this person, this person is son or not, we don't know. Maybe this person, sibling kid, maybe this person. Because we don't know this person is married or not married. Understood or not. So, I cannot place that male here. I cannot place here. I cannot place here. No other choice. That person must be here. Are you understood or not? How much hierarchy I created? Three. And in this three hierarchy, this I put it in the lowest in the hierarchy. This person must be youngest in the family. Who is the youngest? That person is. Are you understood or not? Anybody down? Anybody? Anybody? Any Amadmi? Next day. What gender of he? He is not here? Who is he then? Female. Are you understand this? So where I can... I am not reading next statement. He is not a male means he must be female. Now, can I place he here? No. Can I place he here? Female possible? Possible? I am not, re not reading next statement. I told you. Can I, can I place he here? No. Can I place he here? No, no, yes, sir. Yes, why? No gender means any gender can sit. So for E, how many place possible? Three place possible. Now we are going to finalize one place. What is the next statement? Neither also, yeah? What does it mean? Aji? First, E is married or not married? E is married. And he cannot marry professional. He married other than the professional. Are you understood or not understood? All are understand. Other somebody, what they will think, eh? sir, neither also a wife of professional means somebody wrongly assuming eh? he is not a married. The question is, Swami Nathan is not a Sankara A.S. teacher. What does it mean? He is teaching somewhere. Swami Nathan is not a teacher. He is not at all a teacher. Are you understand the difference in the statement? Are you understand this? So he, he is neither a wife of professional means he must be wife of other than the professional. All are understood the language of the statement boss. All are understood this was what I am saying. Now he cannot marry a professional. Are you understand this? But he must be married. He must be wife of other than the professional. Now listen. Can I write he here? Why? Why? If I write here, he becomes wife of lawyer, so that is not allowed. Can I write he here? Why? He becomes wife of doctor, professional not allowed. So out of three vacant places, these two are not possible. So he must be here and he must be doctor. All are understood and not understood. So if this is female, this person must be male. In this couple, husband must be elder than the wife. They are in the topmost hierarchy. This person must be eldest in the family. Who is the eldest? He must be eldest. Are you understood? Not understood. Who is left out? Who is left out? A and B. What is gender of A? We don't know. What is gender of B? We know. So B is here. Who is left out now? That is all are understood.
Allah understood what I am saying. Anybody doubt? Any Ahmadmi? Bus, last bus. Do you understand what I am saying? Such a lengthy story I have to explain. I will explain. Give me one minute, I will explain. Any other doubt? Anybody asking doubt? Ask everything, why, why not? Understood this. Why I will not make, never made in my life reels all, all this means because everybody cannot read the question in the same way. Depends upon your educational qualification, you will read and understand the question differently. While teaching every topic in uh, basic numeracy, I will tell you why, why not? Why this method? Why not this method? Understood? Because uh, I am not going to write the examination. How I am solving is not important. Why I have to solve like this is very important. Understood? Anybody doubt? Anybody? Okay, totally silent. Eh? Tell me what is asked in the first question. Don't reread the question. I will hang in the camera. I will write your name. Oh, Acha ji. Ah, I apologize. Cancel the problem. So, how he called you? How he called you? Husband. All are understood. What is the next question? Who are the female in the group? Who? E and D. Next. Whose wife is the teacher? Whose? Teacher is wife of whom? Liar or B? What is given in the question? Are you understood? Is it simple or complex, sir? Sir, it's taking more time, sir. So complex, sir. Why complex, sir? Professionals. All are now understand simple and complex. Anji? Acha, Anybody doubt? Anybody? So anybody doubt in family tree based question? Can we shift to coded relation? The time now? Oh, acha, four o'clock. Anji? How do you know this time is correct or wrong? How do you know? How do you know that is correct or wrong? Coming to CSAT class, we don't need that much accurate time. But you are launching a satellite. And you place the satellite in one orbit. You want to push that into another orbit. Every fraction of second is very important. Have you heard about atomic clock? And all this? How can you decide one particular clock is showing correct time, fast or slow? This we all teach, we will teach in clock clock. Are you understand? Three classes minimum. Clock clock. Understood? Yes. So is all are forward, all are understood this? Everybody understand this? Plus is called as what? Brother. In this question, not always. Understood this. Next. Divide is quoted as father. Multiply is quoted as sister. Are you understand? Tell me what is asked in the question. Rereading the question. What is asked in the question? In which in which option P is calling M as what? Uncle. In which option P is called M as uncle? That is asked in the question. That means I have to verify each option. If it is other competitive examination, some option P not there eliminate. Some option M not there eliminate. Even what some student will do. Sir, who is the uncle here? Who is the uncle in this statement? M is, M is higher hierarchy. Sir, M come first, then later stages P come. Somebody will think like that. That is also wrong. Why? Some information are forward, some information are reverse. You will get the wrong answer. All are understood and not understood. I have to verify every option. Anybody doubt? Anybody? I will solve one option. Uh, next also I will see. All are ready? All are exhausted or died? Uh, today is the first day here. So because it, it takes some two to three classes, then we will murder the topic, don't we? So option. Yeah. If I am teacher not enjoyed the topic, it cannot make you to enjoy. Otherwise you feel uh, you will die. Are you, are you, how this person become teacher like that? Listen. So M divide N into P. Are you ready? First, decode it. Remove the sign and write the relation. Divide is quoted as father. Forward or reverse? Forward. This is first arrow. Next, multiply is quoted as sister. Who? Forward or reverse? Forward. The second. Are you understand? First arrow start from where? So I will tell you. But this arrow I am writing is starting point. This is the end point. Tell me, first arrow start from where? M. 
start reading from m in the arrow direction read m is the that means between m and m father is there so same hierarchy no m is the m is the father of yeah are you understood or not understood? second arrow start from where oh one minute between n and p what relation so the same generation or different generation same generation tell me second arrow start from where start reading from n in the arrow direction read n is the sister of p what is gender of p we don't know definitely all are understood or not tell me in this how p call m how p call m this two are sibling how p call m but we need how p call m that means option a is not your all are understood right understand all are getting this getting now you tell me i am not asking what is your answer so in option b tell me how p call m in option c how p call m in option d how p call m tell me quickly we can stop the class today ah uh, i am not asking what is the answer i am asking in option b how p call m anji answer my question how p call m in option b you people na mental like this like this like that group wait for next topic you will never see there understood how p call m in second option kid son or daughter everybody answering how m call p are you understood what i what is asked now how p call m is asked in the question so p call m in second option is what gender of m we don't know so son or daughter will get are you getting or not getting anybody doubt can i draw the diagram for anybody any aam aadmi can i draw the diagram madam joy <laughs> option c tell me how p call ya how p call ya grand how p call ya grandfather ah no uh, then what we will see yes anji anji grandmother grandfather two then remain two options are there grandfather 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 are yeah grand sister also somebody thinking sir solve that option also danger people are there so option c what is option c here m plus s divide r divide first remove the symbol and write the relation first plus c is coded as brother or the reverse or forward first arrow divide is coded as father forward or reverse or don't think father means forward like that it's not like that I understood this divide is coded as what father forward or reverse or forward sir. tell me first arrow start from where m yeah, start read from m in the arrow direction read m is the brother of yes all are understood this second arrow start from where start reading from s yes in the arrow direction s yes, is the father of r all are understood this third arrow start from where r start reading from r in the arrow direction r is the father of what is gender of p we don't know all are understood the diagram now tell me what is asked in the question how p call m yeah. understood this how p call r father how p call s yes. how p call m yeah. grandfather sibling must be what grandfather are you understood or not so a wrong b wrong c wrong d is the answer understood or not all are understood so we will finish, stop the class up to here so i i will finish the topic tomorrow i think it will take another half an hour one hour like that okay bus then we will introduce the new topic in every topic introduction is very important understood this if you have clarity in concept then you can demolish the question understood this bus so wait for someone somebody very slow somebody unable to solve wait for 10 days you yourself feel the change understood this bus enjoy the remaining day.
Thank you, boss.